thinking about getting a Jordan's ironic armory Captain America helmet and don't know what size, watch this video. So what we have here is two of the same helmets but a slightly different size. One over here is on my left is a size 22 circumference. This one is a 23 circumference, I believe. So it's small to medium. I originally got the small to wear because in most masks I will wear a 22 circumference mask um, or helmet or whatever. But it was a little tight on me so um, I contacted him to get the 23 and I put it on today. They look very, very, very similar in size as you can see. I mean, it's like really hard to tell what's the big difference. Well, the big difference is how it feels. Um, here you go. Uh, it's amazing how he put the same exact style of distressing and painting and everything. He has it down to a freaking science. This one has a little bit of foam back here, which is why it looks a little bit bigger. And it's also a little bit bigger of a mask. Okay. As far as the straps and everything else goes, I couldn't tell you which ones were bigger because they're adjustable. So that's not really going to matter. Um, I don't know the sizes as far as going into the large or maybe an extra large. But being that I have two of them at the same time, um, we're going to go over what's the difference in how they feel and why I ultimately will be rocking the medium over the small. Okay. Um, so I'm going to take off the medium, unstrap it from the mannequin head. They, they, they are, both of the mannequin heads here are the same exact size. Now normally, when I put this medium on, it was too large. And I was like, how could the medium be too large and this be too tight? But I just put a piece of foam in it. I don't, I don't know, I just always like putting foam. And we're gonna see something, look. I'm gonna put the medium on. And of course, it looks too big, okay? My ears will be covered and everything. Other than that, it's comfortable. However, I just put a little piece of foam in it for the top and bingo. It's perfect, okay? So we're gonna get a closer look. So now we're gonna have a close up view of the medium. Already I feel great. All right. It's even got a little bit of wiggle room, and that's fine. Um, no pressure in my eyes. Now let's take a profile look. Profile. Okay. Profile is awesome, I'm sure. We're going to try the other profile. Bingo. This, to me, is perfect for me. And I have a 22-inch circumference head. I could fit the other one but I like the comfort in this better, okay? Without the foam, of course, it's going to be a tad bit big on the top. So the, I guess depending on your head shape or whatever, um, you, know, you, you know, that's on you. But on the sides, it's perfect. I do have somewhat of a, of a not so much of a narrow head and kind of a, a thick neck. For my for my size, I'm not that tall, five foot seven or something. So I really, really, really love this size for me. It's perfect, okay. Um, and normally, like I said, I wear a, a 22. Um, could have been a millimeter smaller. Eh, I don't know. I mean, I don't mind putting the foam, and I think that it looks great. So now we're gonna do the 22 inch. So here we are, 
da 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 and I've tried this song before but we're gonna do it again this is the 22 as you can see popping it in is a little bit more difficult once it's on it's not bad right okay and you can probably like I did put foam and stuff to stretch it out but what he's using is a TAS 16 rubber and it will go back into its original shape no matter what. These things do not warp. Beautiful. It looks really fitted. Uh, you know, it looks, you know, like it doesn't have any play. This mask does not have any play, but it will take some getting used to. Um, I do like the way that the ears come out a little bit more on this one. Okay, I, I kind of dig that because I guess that's how Cap's ears are. And, um... We're going to do a profile on this. Neither one is wrong. It all depends on you. Me, I'd rather have a little bit of, um, you know, give in the helmet. But neither one is wrong. Yeah, profile. We're back. Another profile. And, you know, the fact that it's fitted is really a cool look. Um, but if you have, you know, any issues feeling claustrophobic and your head you may want to size up but there is a difference in that little size up so now I'm gonna take it off and we're gonna do some more comparisons so it's really hard to tell the difference like looking at them um, but the one on the left is the medium the one on the right is the small Okay, and he does a great, great job at keeping a consistent uh, paint paint job and um, distressing on it. We'll look at it from the top. Okay, and we see what they look like from the sides. So, um, you know, the best advice that I can give you is, um, you know, Measure your head from your brow to the base of your skull. You know, private message him. He'll let you know what he thinks is best. And, you know, you decide whether you want something more snug or something a little bit looser that you can have room in. Um, but let me know what you think. And don't forget to hit up Jordan's Ironic Armory. Um, for your Captain America helmets, he makes a lot of really great ones. And I absolutely love the work on these. And that, my friend, is how you know which size helmet to buy from Jordan's Ironic Armory. However, you can always ask the expert himself. But as you can see, there are a few differences. Remember to hit the like, the subscribe, and the notification, yada, 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 yada. Be safe. Wear your mask. 